Hey, it's Anna. Welcome back to Consciously Create. And if you're new here, hi. I'm an independent music artist. I write, record, and produce my own music. And I also film four videos a week here on my YouTube. And this series is all about business and branding and marketing and so, so much more. And for this video, we're going to talk about creating content and the mental blockage behind being consistent especially when it comes to perfection, because this is something that I have battled with for years, and I'm not even kidding, it has been years. So <laughs> I'm an expert when it comes to mental blockages, when you wanna express yourself and post your creative content or art or whatever online. So something that I have come to realize, is especially over the last few months, because I've gotten really consistent now with all of my social media posts and even these YouTube videos, I now do four a week, which is just insane, considering I struggled to post just one a week only last year. So it's kind of crazy how much can progress. But what I've learned in this time is that the mental blockage really stems from the idea of needing to please everyone and needing every single person that views your content to like what you're posting. And for me, I've come to realize that not every single person is gonna like my YouTube videos. Not every single person will like my music or how I create them, the way my voice sounds, what my music video looks like. Not everyone's gonna like my jewelry and wanna buy it. Not everyone's gonna want a one-to-one -one session with me. Like, no matter what it is that you do, not everyone is gonna want that or like that or value it, you know? But there will be people that do. So I've really come to realize that we can't hold back on our content or even on like social media and the Instagram posts that you wanna make. You can't restrict yourself and hold yourself back from posting things in fear that, people won't like it because they're gonna be people that do and if we're gonna go down that route of wanting every single person to like it then you're gonna be waiting a very very long time because there's always gonna be someone that doesn't care for it that scrolls right past it that doesn't want to hear your song or doesn't want to buy your product or whatever there's always gonna be people and you can't convince everybody. But what you can do is have your own little community, your own soul tribe, your own group of people that support you and fuck with whatever it is that you do and what you have to offer. So enough with this restrictive shit. No more mental blockages that hold you back. And obviously this is a process. You can't just flick a switch and it will be forgotten and dealt with like it's a daily process to literally reprogram your belief around your worthiness essentially because I would post things and then end up removing all of my posts like I would archive all of my Instagram posts and then start again and with my YouTube videos I deleted so many of them I think at one point I filmed like 10 videos and then I just deleted all of them after I'd gone through all of that effort. So you can like go to all of this trouble and think that you're doing an incredible thing and then the next day or the next week you feel shit about it and feel like it's actually not good and then you want to take it all back down and I feel like a part of the process of becoming comfortable enough to put yourself out there is that you have to go through that sometimes and you have to go through the journey of deleting it and doing it again, deleting it and doing it again because it helps guide you to the types of content that you do want and it also helps get you comfortable creating it. So it's a good thing but at the same time we also need to be aware of the mental blockage that is there because the only reason you would even delete those things in the first place is because you're doubting yourself. It's because you're feeling fear and you're feeling like you're not good enough and you're feeling like other people are going to tell you that you're not good enough. So it really comes to a self-esteem issue and this is like the whole mental blockage that I've come to understand for myself and once you work through that mental blockage and you start to build your self-esteem, you'll build that momentum with your self-esteem to increase it and then you'll be consistent. You can't be consistent if you don't believe in what you're posting, because every time you post even once, you're gonna doubt it and wanna take it back down. So you need the, to have that self-esteem, which obviously takes time. And it doesn't mean that you can't start just because the self-esteem is not 
as high as it should be. Like starting will help build it. Trust me, starting, even though it sounds scary and it's like a crazy kind of leap that you're having to take, but it really will build the self-esteem. The more that you post, the more that you create the content, the more that you film the videos or record the song or brainstorm the new product idea, like the more that you do that, the more confidence you will gain because you're gaining the experience with it and you're learning about it. You're learning what you don't like. You're learning what you do like and you can utilize the strengths that you then uncover about yourself along the way, you know? So you learn as you go and as you go, you'll build that self-esteem. But just being aware of the fact that if you're hesitating and you're wanting to delete things as soon as you posted it, then it's time to look at your self-esteem. It's time to look at the lack of belief that you're having in yourself and where that stems from so that you can begin to change it. And I will link videos, I think it's this side, up here talking further into belief systems and self-worth and things like that if, that, if that's something that you want to watch. But yeah, I think this video is mainly about being aware of that thing so then you can actually come to work through it. So I hope this video was helpful. Thank you so much for watching. If you would like a one-to-one -one session with me, the link to that is in the description box below on my website, as well as links to my social media, my music, my phone number, because I do send daily inspirational spiritual thoughts, as well as Elemental Mirror, my clothing jewelry brand, and everything else about me and yeah i will see you in the next video you can also definitely um send me any video suggestions if there's anything that you want me to film definitely let me know and i will see you in the next video bye it's always been lying, lying.